What's going on, guys? It's me, Don, from You Can Do It Gaming. How you guys doing? Not so good? <laughs> Are these bugs and glitches getting to you yet? Yeah, me too. Uh, we should definitely, definitely demand. Well, you know, saying a hostage situation or something, anything, but you know, that these issues get fixed quickly, like so many other issues haven't in the past. Uh, we all do put a lot of time and or money into this game and we shouldn't have to lose when we win and and who else who knows what else could be going wrong all the game modes seem to be you know on the fritz and I'm just hoping like other things aren't going wrong that I'm not noticing too like you know um items and stuff you know um i just bought some stuff you know so what if i'm not noticing like ten thousand rings i just collected didn't stick you know so i've been doing a lot of screenshots lately so i can go back and look you know it's always a good idea to screen screenshot your inventory i was i was and i'm still going to make a whole video about that uh, you know is it a good idea to screenshot your inventory or not of course it is you know I even took a screenshot of this town hall being maxed out and uh, in its armor you see if it wasn't maxed out it would have it would have like what this has um, an armor, an armor, uh, option there to, you know, use souls to add another layer of armor or however you want to, uh, describe that. So anyways, I feel you guys, I feel you, uh, this is probably the worst one, or the worst update for bugs and stuff. Um, and hopefully it's just in the game modes and we're not losing all kinds of inventory that we're not even aware of. So, um, like so many others have before me, including Komar and Opster, uh, they have recommended that we all... Shoot IGG a life support ticket or uh, there's other ways of getting a hold of them too through the, I think it's like the developer thing through where you actually download the, the game uh, in the Google Play Store you can actually find it down at the bottom like different ways to contact IGG and all that uh, yeah more the better that we get emailing them and, you know, just getting in contact with them. Letting them know of our concerns and frustrations and all that stuff. I'm sure the faster that, especially a large group of us. So, oh yeah. Not only about the bugs, but about the global merger thing too. Now, Komar and Opster, I'm not sure if anyone else has or not, but I know those two have have both made videos on it um, you can always share those with the, with the IGG staff somehow or another you know um, and there's plenty of videos and screenshots out there on a lot of the social media Clash of Lords 2 uh, channels you know uh, people are posting all kinds of pictures of 
there are bugs and glitches and stuff. <laughs> I've had a lot too, guys. Um, okay, with all that being said, I want to share some of my good times with you. Yeah, I can still have a good time while this is going on, and I hope you guys can too. Um, and also, really quick, you know, big shout out to Komar and a big shout out to Opster. I know sometimes I leave Opster out, and I really shouldn't because he's put a lot of work into his videos and into his Discord and into his wiki page, I think it's called. So. Be sure to check his channel out too. I'll leave his Discord and Wiki and all that, those links and stuff in, in the comments, if I can. <laughs> I'm sure I can find his his Discord and his YouTube channel link, but I don't, I'm not so sure about the... I'm not so sure about the Wiki thing. I think it's called Wiki page. Or... You know Wikipedia, <laughs> uh, but yeah, he's put a lot of his heart and soul into this for others to enjoy too. And you know, if he's if you're by any chance watching this Oster, uh, I just want you to know personally that you know I didn't mean anything by ever leaving you out when you know. It's just, um, Komar's kind of the go-to, you know, he's the, he's the man, he's the Clash of Lords 2 man for now, right? <laughs> You'd be like the second, I guess, you know, <laughs> I'm way down on the list, so, you know, who am I anyways, right? But, you know, I just, I just want to put that out there, you know, because, just because, just because, because I should have... I guess I should have shouted you out more, probably, you know, and included you on a lot of stuff. There's also a lot of other YouTubers out there that I should bring up more often, too. <laughs> uh, and I'll try to from now on. Okay? Deal? Deal. Okay. So let's get on with my good times. And that is, as you guys can tell by the thumbnail, is my new event here. It is called the Pumpkin Patch Pick'em Party, but I renamed it the Heart Patch Pick'em Party. Real creative there, huh? <laughs> um, I liked it anyhow. I have hearts all over the pumpkin heads, heart heads instead of pumpkin heads, and I crossed out pumpkin and put down heart down here underneath. <laughs> so 50 tries for this, guys. So this ain't just by events it's free to play events too those 300 jewels are more than i usually get dang 400 oh i tried to tap the i tried tried to tap the big pumpkin head dude's pumpkin head and it didn't work <laughs> that should be one too right Maybe use up two or three or seven hundred five uh, of your chances to hit the actual pumpkin head pumpkin. Uh, and perhaps it gives you a bigger chance. Ooh, one thousand gems, yes, of getting some of the bigger uh, sized prizes you know what I'm saying it's an idea just a s small idea <laughs> yay look at all the gems come on come on give me give me a good thousander thousander yeah <laughs> 600, that's juicy. Is 600 juicy? <laughs> 400 is not bad. Heck, anything other than... 100 is good to me. Uh, 2, 
And last one. 100. I knew it. Yeah, stinker, ew. <laughs> hey, it didn't glitch one time. So that's a win. Some of, some of the other buy event, uh, events here have been glitching bad. Okay. Let me go ahead and pick this. I've had to do this one earlier because, you know, it resets every eight hours. So, yeah, I had to go ahead and get what I needed. Or get, got what I could. <laughs> Does it cost gems to reset it? Uh, just two, 200 for the first time. Um, and then if it resets again, it's still only 200 again for the first time. So that's always the best way to go around, go about doing that. Um, yeah, I like that 900 one there. The 1,000 points for the... And it glitched. <laughs> See, that's what I was talking about. Like, right there, like, when it glitches on that, like, and since I haven't really even been paying attention to my jewel total, if I even got those 900 gems or not, you know, like, a lot of that stuff we would probably just overlook, you know. Uh, oh, I was going to pick those potions, and then I didn't. I went right for the jewels. And in fact, those enchant crystals would have been nice too. What did I do? <laughs> I'm going to reset this one. Oh, wait. That said 800 points to reset, did it? Ouch. Oh, well. I only would have got shards anyhow. <laughs> uh, oh, it's going wild. I spent a lot of gems, but I only have 1,500 left. Oh no, sorry about the message. It's like I said yesterday. Won't get any, but then as soon as I start recording, never fails, left and right, there they are. <laughs> oh no! Uh, I'll have to make sure and... Uh, Turn off my notifications from here on out, you guys. I don't want anybody coming after me for one of their messages being posted over my, over our, or my glitches, or, I mean, videos. <laughs> uh, see what I did there? Uh... Uh, you know, I could, I think I could just pull this down here and put, go into settings. Just bear with me real quick. Turn off the line app, right? And then go back into there. Okay, yeah, that's better. Sorry about that, but I think it's better than, it's like, uh, kind of unnerving me and we're back to the winter car carnival and if you guys remember i wanted to hold off on this until today and i'm really glad i did because i ended up with enough to claim the thirty thousand one instead of the 10 or the 15 and even though there's probably reasons to Or arguments to be made to get the 10 and 15. Those of you that have been been watching my videos know that I'm after those two stars right there. Those two star glyph shards. Plus it gives you 50 of those nuts. I think they're called nuts, aren't they? Yeah. Or bell, bells exchange. Are they bells? I don't know. Uh, 
I did find out the best thing to trade these bells in for, though. And look at this. You can see it right there. There's a winner's... Um, this one here. What is it called? Uh, winner's Secret and Winner's Rage. Yeah, Rage times 10 for 15 of those. But then you got a Winner's Secret times 10 for only 10. You see that? For only 10 bells, you get Winner's Secret shards, which are usually more expensive than the Winter's Rage shards. But in this case, they are not. Um, yeah, I could go for the start, the anniversary star ones too, but those are 20 each. So I'm going to go ahead and get 50 of these bad boys. I really do think of that, you know, as far as the glyph shards go, your best bet is to, and you can, yeah, you see, you can, you can exchange these 10 times too. So if you guys didn't know about that. I'm glad that I was the one who who was able to uh, let you in on that because that's the best deal right there by far, you know. Winner's Secret Glyph Shards, 10 of them, for 10 bells. Whereas all the other ones are 10 for all the other sets and they're at least 15 bells or 20 bells. Even... <laughs> Even that one. Even that one's more expensive. You know, the first one in the winner's thing is more expensive than the hexagon one. Here, I'll show you. Or, I'll show myself here. Because um, the names are slipping me now. Uh, the Winter's Embrace was actually more expensive than the Winter's Rage. Did you see it? And the Winter's Rage was more expensive than the Winter's Secret. In that event so if you're a buyer it's definitely the best deal right yeah 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 let's see if I'll be a winner here with you guys you guys always bring me luck when I do these when I do these on here or when I'm video maybe IGG has some kind of advanced tech that picks up if uh, if we're recording or something while we're uh, while we're playing their game and like time to shine boys Mr. Don is record and see there I won <laughs> woo alright guys Thank you guys. I, you guys definitely. You know, I never won both of those before at the same time. That would be something if I did. I think I've won one or the other. Or maybe I haven't ever won gifts before. You know, I've always been like one away for like so many. Oh. Like right now. Come on, T. Come on, T. Woo, 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 T. T bone steak. All that to a T. <laughs> it's not going to give it to me, is it? Come on. Mm, a ten times higher pass. It's decent. Oh, wait! Oh! I'm the next Publisher's Clearinghouse winner. I did it, guys! Woo! I am a winner. <laughs> mm. So. See? See? I knew you guys gave me luck. That's all you guys right there. Thank you guys. Thank you. 
I already did tarot, because I know you guys probably don't want to watch that tarot. Let's go to Ancient Spirit Jackpot. Shall we? We shall. We shall. So anyways. Hope you guys are having a good weekend. A good Sunday here. Well, for those... You know... That it is still Sunday for, anyway. If not, I hope y'all having a good Monday, or... Or whatever. Um, I really am happy that I decided to record now, because of that. <laughs> and I really hope that you guys out there are getting some kind of entertainment and maybe just maybe learn something you didn't know about the game perhaps with that event maybe you know um, I didn't really seem to know that uh, about the glyph shards on that one event until like maybe like the past three or four times I I did it I usually got different stuff other than glyph shards from that event. You know, from the Winter Carnival event. Smash eggs and egg monster. Wow. And I feel like JT is all business almost on, on these events. He plays Castle Clash though. And actually he's been like, he's been MIA. For like months now. Last thing we heard I think. I think anyway was. That he was moving. And he was. He was definitely Castle Clash's. Biggest YouTuber by far. And one of the first ones too. Um, has like. 150, 160,000 subscribers. And all of a sudden. No one's heard of him for months. But. But. Anyway, my point was, is, like, he, he used to put so much money into this game. He would have, like, every day, he would just show. He would record all the buying events. Chances and stuff. Like, I am right here, right now. And he would always have, like, so many chances. And I'm just, like, thinking, like, man. Like, you'd have to get, I mean, you'd have, usually it would have to put in at least, like, twenty dollars or so t at least ten or twenty dollars just to get like one chance right and he'd always have like 50 to 100 chances on every event like wow man last time i saw one of his videos i think he had like 2.5 million gems and and he spent gems like crazy too. Crazy, crazy. He would do all these like crazy amount of hero hiring and all that stuff. And he still had that much gems. I'm saying he had, he definitely put tens of thousands of dollars into that game. Man. And now it, it's just kind of a shame. I only need like couple hundred more points for that one. Might have to do some more tap joy. Oh, you know, since I'm on the tap joy subject, or since I brought it up myself anyway, it's not, I didn't really bring up the whole subject of it or anyway. But I did hit my mark, or our mark, of over 100,000 gems in one month. I hit that a long time ago. And, as you can see, it's still, it's only January 17th. And, you know, the... Pretty much the contest or that last video I'm referring to, we was questioning whether we could get 100,000 gems in 30 days. And I blew that out of the water, guys. I mean, you know, for one of those Tap Joy offers, I got like 33,000 gems right off the bat. So, so yeah. Um, the reason why I haven't 
done any more videos follow to follow that up uh is because no one seemed to be interested or or giving me any kind of feedback on it at all you know uh so you know i'm not gonna i don't want to make recordings of things that no one wants to watch or no one seems interested in you got right i mean um i've don't get me wrong i i've had have i have had subscribers be um, interested in i tap joy videos but not for clash awards too for some of the different games that i that I make videos for to like mainly Castle Clash, okay? <laughs> um, it's just not as big over here on Clash of Lords 2. But you guys should give it a second, you should give it a second chance, or you know, you should, uh, Consider it. Reconsider. You guys should reconsider doing some tap joy offers. I will find you, or I will let you know what the quickest, easiest ones are. You know, uh, some of them are only like an hour. I mean, you put like an hour gaming time. You know, it's it's just gaming, so you know it's not like work or anything. <laughs> an hour of gaming. And less, I mean, you know, you can easily get you four or five thousand joules, you know, I mean, it's not too bad, that's pretty nice, actually. Um, the one I was talking about where I got 33,000, I actually donated to, I think it's called the ASPC a or something like that it's like an animal abuse thing and it and i'm not even really sure if anyone if you guys got it or not because it's actually uh it's actually a company or whatever that's based here in ohio my home state so you know what i'm getting at like is tap joy offers seem to be uh, seem to uh, get offered to only certain areas of the globe <laughs> let alone uh, so they might be more location specific you know than than I'm already thinking you know uh it might even they might even go further i know that they already do base it on different countries and stuff but they might even do it even you know have even stricter type of uh, guidelines they use you know like states like different states or or just whatever but anyways i'm rambling on <laughs> uh, I really thought about what I would say about all that, but I just wanted to bring up the tap joy because you know I made up I made videos about it before, and if anyone had been wondering about it, please let me know. Please let me know if you want me to make some more videos covering some of that stuff. You know, uh, I would really be like I would really like to be that guy that saves you some some time and money. You know by by directing you to towards you know the the fastest and the easiest offers um and making them that much easier you know and just you know definitely interested in that some of my first videos are tap joy videos believe it or not here's another one 
Oh, yeah. Some more uh, costume shards. Um, that's what they're called, yeah. Hero costume. Down to 22. <laughs> uh, so I guess I'll probably call it there. Did I go through pretty? Don't forget your guys' login giveaways. Um, winter smash eggs. We did it, right? Yeah, letter hunt. Yeah, because I won. And then I did those other ones earlier. Because I, I just don't think those are the greatest uh, events to share. To be honest. Okay. So, anywho, toodaloo, I guess. It's been a long, a lot longer than I thought it was going to be. So, if you made it this far, jeez, you're awesome. <laughs> I probably wouldn't have watched me for that long, that's for sure. Um, as always, so, 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 so appreciative of y'all stopping by and commenting and Maybe watching. I hope you guys at least watch for at least 30 seconds. So that will get at least give me one view. <laughs> yeah, it takes 30 seconds to get one view. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> Please like, subscribe, comment, share, any of that kind of stuff. You know, uh, check out all the other U Clash of Lords YouTubers too. Uh, one one, Komar Gaming Komar, Opster, Opster, uh, and many others. Uh, Slip in my mind right now. My mind's going blank. Sorry. <laughs> um, and it, have a good day, you guys. Happy gaming. Uh, don't let the bugs and the glitches get the better of you. All right. So. Happy gaming. Thanks for watching. And anywho what? And anywho who? Anywho toodaloo you guys. Anywho toodaloo. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Happy gaming. And anywho toodaloo. Until next time. I'm done. From You Can Do Gaming. Bye-bye.